Hello everyone, welcome to the channel. Today, in this video, we are going to learn how to create checkbox field type in Salesforce. And we are going to discuss this topic in both the edition, in Salesforce Lightning as well as Classic. So, before we will proceed to learn how to create it, we will first discuss what is checkbox field type in Salesforce. The checkbox field type in Salesforce is defined as the field that permits the user to select the single option that is represented by a checkbox within the record. It is mainly used to specify yes, no, or true or false for unchecked or checked condition. It is also defined as the field that can only be checked or unchecked in Salesforce. Here, the true represents the value of the checkbox as a 1 and the false represents the value of the checkbox as a 0. When we creating a checkbox field, we must identify the field properties like field name, field label, data type, etc. The checkbox value contains the billion values true for the checked and the false for the unchecked. The checkbox field can be added to the custom or standard object and together with the custom objects, contacts, accounts and opportunities. This checkbox can be involved in reports and page layout and used in the workflow rule, validation rule, formula field, etc. Now, move forward and discuss how to create checkbox field in Salesforce Lightning. This is my Lightning code and here we creating the checkbox field. For this, we firstly click on the gear icon. This is my gear icon. Click on that and under this gear icon, you can see that the two options are present. First one is setup option and the another one is service setup. Click on the setup option. After clicking on the setup option, our setup page is open and here you can see that the two tabs are present. First one is the home tab and the another one is the object manager tab. Click on the object manager tab. After clicking on the object manager tab, the object manager page is open. Here you can see that lots of objects are already present. From this, we select the one of the object and we want to select the account object. So click on the account object. The account page is open. Here you can see that the details related to the account are shown. And on the left side under the details section, there is a field and relationship option. Click on this option. After clicking on the field and relationship, the field and relationship page is open. Here you can see that the some fields are already created, but we want to create the new field. So click on the new button. After clicking on the new button, the account new custom field page is open. Here we can choose the field type. We want to choose the checkbox field type. So scroll to the bottom of the page and you can see that this is the checkbox field. So click on the checkbox and uh, after that click on the next button. The account new custom field page is open. Now enter the complete information related to the account object. And here we first fill the field name. And here we are filling the field name as do not contact. And after that we set the default value as unchecked. And then click on the field name which is automatically filled by simply clicking on the field name. After filling the field name now click on the next button. Here we can establish the field level security, select the profile to which we want to grant the added access to this field via field level security. The field will be hidden from all the profiles if we do not add it to the field level security. For adding the field level security to all the profiles, we click on the visible checkbox and then click on the next button. And here we can add to the page layout. Select the page layout that should include this field. The field will be added as the last field in the first two column section of these pages layout. The field will not appear on any pages if we do not add to the page. If we do not select a layout. To change the location of this field on the page, we will need to customize the page layout. And uh, change the value that appear. We will need to customize the record type also and click on the save button. After creating the checkbox field, we come back to our field and relationship page. Now scroll to the bottom of the page and we can see that uh, our uh, do not contact checkbox field is created successfully. Now move forward and want to create checkbox field in Salesforce Classic. For this, we switch to our Salesforce Classic version. 
So click on the profile picture and under this profile picture there is an option switch to Salesforce Classic. Click on this option and after clicking on the switch to Salesforce Classic option, our Salesforce Classic version is open. Now here we want here we can create our checkbox field. So for this, firstly click on the username. The drop down list is open and select the setup option. Our setup page is open. Now enter the object in the quick find box and the object is present under the create app and click on the object option. Our custom object page is open. Now scroll to the bottom of the page and select the object you want. Here we are selecting the expense object. Our expense object page is open. Now scroll to the bottom of the page. Here you can see that there is a custom field and relationship section. And under this section, lots of fields are already created. But we want to create the new field. So click on the new button. After clicking on the new button, our choose the field type page is open. Here we can choose any field which we want to choose. And here we are selecting the checkbox field. So click on the checkbox and uh, click on the next button. Now enter the complete details related to the expense checkbox field. Firstly fill the field label and here we are filling the field label as contact us. And then set the default value as unchecked and after that click uh, enter the field name which is entering by simply clicking on the field and click on the next button. Now establish the field level security. Select the profile to which we want to grant added access to this field via field level security. The field will be hidden from all the profiles if we do not add it to the field level security. For adding all the profile to the field level security, check the visible checkbox and click on the next button. Now we want to add to the page layout. Select the page layout that should be include this field. The field will be added as the last field in the first two column section of this page layout and click on the save button. Now we come back to our custom object expense page. Now scroll to the bottom of the page and under the custom fields and relationship section, we can see that our checkbox field contact us is created successfully. So with this, we have learned how to create checkbox field type in Salesforce. So if this video was helpful, click on the like button and also subscribe to our YouTube channel for more videos. Like this one, thanking you for watching. Have a great day.